In this movie I would like to talk about exactly what 3D is and how it works. Now currently I have a software package open which is called Cinema 4D and don't worry you don't need Cinema 4D to finish this course or to follow along. However I just have it open for the purpose of showing these things. Now I personally use Cinema 4D to make our characters and uh, models and in this case a little turret for our games and import them back into Unity 3D. Now let's look at the basics of 3D design. Everything in the world or in a 3D engine or 3D application consists of dots, lines and squares. Now if I select this top part of the turret you can see that it consists of lines and basically panels. Everything in 3D starts with dots and these dots are called vertices or if you're only talking about one dot a vertex and I can move these around of course and create multiple ones to form a 3D image now these vertices are connected with lines which are called edges now of course you guessed it that when those edges come together into a square it is called a polygon and of course polygons can also be moved around or scaled to create the look and feel that you need. Now polygons are then taken and unwrapped. For example when you unwrap a cube you get a cross symbol or when you unwrap this 3D character you get something that looks like this. Now this is called a UV map because it is an unwrapped texture map of our turret. This texture map is then taken into a 3D painting application like Photoshop or Cinema 4D and you can paint on there to create the texture. As soon as you export it back into Unity though, this texture is a separate item that we can attach to objects to add some effects to it. For example, what part of this turret is reflective or what part of this turret is embossed out or things like that. So that is basically how 3D works in any 3D type of environment.